How the coaching carousel brings about changes every offseason in every sport. New faces take over programs. Even with different leadership, past success can translate. Iowa Park Baseball is displaying continuity as front runners for yet another district title. MJ Baird caught up with the Hawks, our Team of the Week. It's the same old success for Iowa Park Baseball, despite a new face at the helm. Heath Taylor now leading the Hawks, and the success on the Diamonds remains strong. You know, it's a learning process. You know, I, this is my fifth year in Iowa Park. Four years I was the pitching guy. You know, it's a, it's a, it's a whole different... It's a whole different aspect of the game that, that I'm trying to do, and you know I try to do the best that I can for those guys. I have great coaches, so I'm very blessed to have guys around me that know the game as well. Iowa Park has won eight straight district championships dating back to 2014. Once again, the Hawks are keeping tradition alive. A 5-0 start to district play. They're in the driver's seat to extend the streak. Oh, you know, just uh, continue to come out here, work hard, trust the process, just whoever's out there at third base, just trusting what they have to say and uh, trying to get it done at the end of the day. He's uh, kept a lot of things the same, switched up a little things, just, you know, him being him, but uh, man, most things have stayed the same and uh, just keeping that tradition going. 13-5 and five through their first 18 games, the Hawks actually started slow. They lost the first two games of the season, now putting everything together and finding their group. We've come a long way from where we were at first. Um, I'd say our defense. Our defense has gotten really solid. At first, we, we were allowing a couple errors a game, and now we've been pretty much error free for a couple games. So, I mean, we just work hard every day and day in, day out. So, make sure we keep it going. Towards the middle end of the district, that's when we really want to be going. Once you get hot, you know, never know what can happen. So, we want to be able to be playing some of our better baseball now and just continue that and maybe even get a little bit better. This team hoping to finish strong their final season in Class 4A before realignment sees the Hawks drop to 3A. With your Team of the Week, I'm MJ Baird. The Hawks are back on the field tomorrow at Hoskins Field here in Wichita Falls as they take on the Hershey Huskies. First pitch is slated for 430.